Right, time to change to super secret game mode survival. Oh god, no. Get away. Not like this. Hopefully I picked up all my stuff. I'm going to start running back in the direction of that maze we saw. I'd, hopefully this is the direction. I'd quite like to explore it, honestly. Can't see the kobold chasing us any longer. Uh, fix our kit again. Uh, this goes here. Oh, <laughs> I thought you were a kobold for a second there. Similar shade of blue. Didn't mean to misidentify you. My apologies. Okay, here's the maze. Oh, thought I saw some wooden planks there for a second. I was mistaken. Do excuse me. Okay. Right, um, just, just so that we're not actually constantly dying. Let's, let's get some things sorted out here, shall we? Uh, firstly, let's put away uh, all, all, all the stuff we don't need right now, including eggs, pork chops, and just about everything else. Boop, 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 boop. Two death notes. That's pretty funny. Uh, and if I might be permitted on this most auspicious of occasions to uh, pop back into super, 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 not, not just super, super secret special creative mode that uh, it's a special mode of Minecraft that no one knows about except me. Um, we can grab ourselves. Tell you what, let's... Let's, let's do let's do some of that, some of that, and just just some basic armor, just stuff that you might expect to have. Do, 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 to totem of Undying. That's something that I actually have never had in Minecraft because you never find me playing new versions of it. Generally speaking, uh, do 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 do. do, do. Do, do. There you go. Jobs are good. Okay. Um, I'm actually going to fight with my axe here. So, so we got we got spawners around here. That is singularly unimpressive loot. Oh, something was getting hit. And it wasn't me, surprisingly enough. Sounds like a skeleton taking damage from something, but I don't know what. Uh-oh. Hi. <gasps> okay. Angry wolves. That's a thing. That's fine. We can, we can take care of angry wolves. Tell you what we can do. We can break your spawner. How about that, mate? Um, okay, uh, this is slightly better loot, I suppose. I'll just take the arrows. I don't need the other stuff. Oh. Right, this is, this is far from being the center of the maze. Let's, let's try and look. look for, oh, hi. Hedge spider. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have broken that so we could have a look at hedge by a diamond hole. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Um, so maybe the middle is in this sort of direction? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Is that the one that we saw before? Mazes, man. 
Uh, how about this way? Might, might that be a thing we'd want to do? Maybe, maybe not. Mostly not. I just want to find some new stuff. Can I have some new stuff, please? Do I just end up looking in the same chests over and over again? Is that what's happening here? There's the diamond hoe again. Tell you what, how about this? Ow! Well, that's a problem. That... Oh, hi. Okay, edge spiders are a thing. Can I break? No. See? I appreciate that. Uh, tell you what we're going to do. Let's start putting a stone block. Oh, hi. So, I mean, uh, these mazes don't have the best loot you could possibly imagine, admittedly. Swarm spider. I want to see these. Come on. Out you come. Ow. Or not, you know. Oh, so cute. Can you... That didn't hurt. Going to try again? Yeah, clearly, uh, clearly that spider is not a very formidable spider. Maybe if you had a really large number of them, they'd be able to do damage, I don't know. Say goodbye, spawner. So, um... Yeah, that, that was mazes. Um, let's get out of here if we can. And... Find our stuff if we can. Right, how much of this stuff do we actually need? That's the question. Probably not a whole lot. Um, for the purpose of what we're doing. Uh, I think we've read these books. There may have been something that we missed. But, but I, th I think we may have read all of them. Right, so. So here's the thing. Uh, the thing is, why are these chunks not loading into the minimap? That's, that's the thing. Seems rather odd behavior for a mini-map, if you ask me. So, I noticed that... Oh, wait. Yeah, I noticed that there's tons and tons of hostile mobs showing up around here. Some of them are kind of more behind me, so they can't all be uh, in the maze. So I'm wondering where they are. Underground, I guess. Okay. Moving on. I noticed that these uh, little obsidian stacks have a block of lapis at the top of them, which obviously... And there's, maybe there's always a raven at the bottom. What happens if you do something precipitous like, like murder the raven? You hover weirdly through the air. I noticed that I did you almost no damage though. 
with a critical attack with my axe, so... You're, you're a pretty damn tough raven, seemingly. Uh, we have another maze. But we've had a maze so far. Oh, oh, wait. This is actually a house. With a spawner. Oh, excuse the lag. With a spawner that's lit up. Except the outside of the houses aren't lit up by themselves. So let, let's have a look at this monster if we can. Out you pop. I want to see what you look like. Come on. Oh, I hear one. I was going to say, don't be shy. Wait, what? Where did you... Sp Where are you? Am I just hearing a skeleton that's underground or something like that? Just by coincidence. Ravens again. Oh, God! Oh, you fire spells. Okay. Well, uh, that was a little unfortunate. Did I get anything out of that? Uh, that's, oh, pumpkin on your head this time, huh? Right, so... They don't seem to be, uh, at least the first couple tries, weren't giving me super duper drops. Oh god, there's two of them! Let's get out of here. They're fast. No, they seem to have lost interest. Very easily bored. Okay, so that's a thing. We destroyed their spawner, at least. Which, honestly, half the time you could probably just run up to the house. Oh, come on. Yeah. Apparently eating isn't the thing. <laughs> it's very strange. I have no idea why that's happening. See, oh, there we go. I was going to say, seriously, though, I do need to actually replenish my hunger bar at some point. So what else do we got? Ridiculously huge trees. See, I find myself wondering if there's anything up in those trees. We're not going to check right now because it would take a long time to get to the top. Wait, what if there's something inside, though? Well, would you look at this? Huh. There's vines all the way up to the top. Let's have a look, shall we? Okay, here we are. Let's try and get ourselves a view. Um... We head up this sort of way. So, um, yeah, this tree doesn't have anything at the top except a view. Is how it seems. I mean, that's okay. Views are nice. We have another one of the uh, Naga courtyards over there. It's all quite pretty. What's that? Is that something over there? Like some sort of little hut or something. Little mud hut? Maybe we should go and check that out. <laughs> I 
Uh, I was going to do a dramatic jump there, but I, uh, I missed my jump. You were going to be wondering just for a split second, Commodore, what are you doing? But, uh, actually, no. It all turned out to be rather less melodramatic than that. Anyway, let's go and see if we can find this, um... This mud hut, if indeed it is a mud hut. I think it's in this direction. Another one of these henges. Oh, it's, 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 it's not a hut. It's fallen... What's this? Moss patch. Ow! Ow! What, really? I can hear another one. I think. That, that hurt rather a lot. Okay, so we got... Oh, you don't get anything when you destroy the moss patches. Okay. Hearing creepy sounds coming from somewhere. Random outcrop of stone and coal on the ground. That's certainly not something that you find in, uh, well, not in that sort of formation in normal Minecraft. That's definitely, that's definitely a twilight forest thing. Can't help but noticing that there's a whole load of mobs this way. Oh, I think I might have seen... Wait, what? Okay. Not sure how I'm getting quite so much lag in a single player game. See, I think I may have seen someone playing Twilight Forest. And there's such a thing as a hollow hill. Something like that. And this hill is kind of suspicious looking in its configuration. I can hear... Creatures. Are they above me, or...? They're certainly all around me. Yeah, there's stuff in here. <gasps> <laughs> okay, I nearly fell in. What we got here? We got what seemed to be poison spiders. Well, that's pretty nasty. Let's see if we can approach in a more sensible fashion. Uh, oh, there's a chest there. I can hear... I can hear very strange noises. Can you hear? Yeah, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> that's, that's a very funny noise. Okay. Let's just get in here at ground level. Oh, God. Uh, I imagine... Okay. I imagine that poison spiders could get at me here. Oh, there's a dude! You gonna give me any trouble? Let's give him trouble. Uh, let's do some blocking off of angles. Now I suspect that this guy's going to try and attack me as soon as 
Yeah, here he comes. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Did he take out the skeleton? I think he did. Okay. Take some of that, though. Don't like that much, do you? Okay, yeah, it's a hollow hill. That's what we've got going on. Now, the reason that I'm doing this is to give myself a defensible position. Because there is tons of spiders. That spider... Sorry, that skeleton had a pumpkin on his head. Can't help but notice. Very appropriate for Halloween. Yeah, that's definitely a poison spider. So... Oh. Come on, then. Right. This is fine. What we get? Oh! Well, this is a new thing. What's, what's this? Transformation powder. Okay. Transformation powder. You can't do anything with it. You can't craft anything with it, seemingly. But, oh, hello. Dang it, missed. Oh, curse you. Right. I can see there's a spawner up there. Oh, nearly looked at an enderman. So I want to know what this transformation powder does. Ow. Uh, tell you what. How about that? Um, so let's see what happens if we say right click with it. It doesn't have dura... Let's try using this on a mob. No? You don't want to be transformed? You don't want to make over? Ooh. Okay, that's fine. Let's go and try and transform something else, shall we? Now, it could there could be a very sort of special niche usage for this. It might work on only one specific thing somewhere. Oh! Well, there's something it works on. <laughs> yeah, it works. It works on ravens and turns them into bats. Well, that's fantastic. How incredibly useful. There's probably better stuff that you can use it for, but, um, okay. Well, this whole, uh, hollow hill thing. Wait, where did I go in? Ah, here it is. Tell you what. Whoops. This is all pretty exciting. Let's have a bit more of a look at this. Uh, boo -doo. Let's see if, let's see if we can murder all the things. Oh, hello. What? <gasps> well, that was worrying. Ow. Run. This is fine, except that I'm nearly dead. <gasps> I actually managed to kill it. I was thinking, surely, surely this 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 ghosty ghost is going to be some it's going to be some hot stuff. He's going to wreck me, but uh, apparently they're not too bad. Uh, 
I've got some zombies starting to build up. I'm going to use my advanced super hostile skills. As garnered in super hostile online <laughs> over the last couple of days, I suppose. Um, okay. How about that? How'd you like that? Yo, bunch more dudes. Take that. Take that. Oh, we're hurting. Forgot to heal right up properly. Now, if we could uh, successfully eat, yeah, that would be fantastic. Great. So. Oh. Did that creep? Oh, hello! <laughs> <laughs> a scorpion, eh? Uh, could you please not destroy my uh, my shelter, sir? Good, good, good. See, this has turned really fun now. Uh... <gasps> Hello? What do you do? Ow! Oh god, he's grabbed me! I couldn't- I couldn't shake him free until he died. That was terrifying. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, you're not all that. You're not that tough. So here's a question. Uh, well, this, this, these beetles must have been spawning from spawners, right? So, so where? Oh, things! I got things. I've been rewarded with 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 many things. All right, let's see what this is. Uh, ore magnet. Ironwood pick. Fortune one. Ah. It looks like it's... Uh-oh. Looks like it's... Oh, come on. Like it's time to do a bit more of uh, this. Because we have... Oh, come on. What hit me? Oh, right. Okay. It's a Halloween zombie. Right. Um. Pop this down. Sort out our nonsense. No, I want that. Uh, do, 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 do. Someone coming. That's fine, though. Do, 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 do. This is easily the most exciting thing that I've found so far. <laughs> uh, what does it? What does an ore magnet do? You can enchant them on an anvil, with mending, unbreaking, and a curse of vanishing. What happens if you? Uh, what if I break? Okay, yeah, I'm not 100% sure what that's doing, honestly. It's clearly doing something. Oh, wait. It lost some durability. I don't know. Okay. 
Let's deal with this spider, uh, sorry, this scorpion, who appears to be wearing sunglasses. Uh, during twilight, in a cave. I don't know if he thinks he's a member of the Blues Brothers or something. Let's just go and try and kill him. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, nothing, turns out the answer is. Let's, um... Yeah, yeah, spider, whatever. So, uh, so yeah, these places, full of, full of things. Full of ores, full of new monsters. Ow. Okay, I'm, I'm poisoned at this point. Alright. Time to regroup and decide what to do next. And cut! Right, chaps, I've made an executive decision somewhere along the lines of, oh, bloody hell, I've been recording for ages already, and I'm going to have to split this into a couple of episodes as it is, which is not normally what I would do with a, with a let's try or something of that sort. So it's probably time to stop uh, more or less now, because... Well, I mean, in order for me to progress a lot further and do much more stuff other than just kind of wandering around looking at things, um, I'd have to spend a long time in the game and uh, beat a bunch of bosses, do, 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 do all sorts of things. And uh, that, that isn't what these, uh, this video, or rather these two videos now are for. I didn't need those ankles anyway. So um, I think that's it for now. Hope you enjoyed this little look at the Twilight Forest for 1.12.2. Uh, if you did, do please click the like button. It helps out rather a lot. Leave your thoughts and suggestions in the comments section below. Share this video with anyone you think might be interested or entertained. And subscribe if, and only if, you'd like to see more. Ta-ta for now, chaps.